webcasting live from the Orleans Hotel and Casino in the boxing capital of the world, Las Vegas, Nevada. Crown Boxing proudly presents World Championship Boxing. Tonight's webcast is brought to you in part by ActionRanch.com. And we have a legend here in the house tonight, Mr. Boza Edwards and his lovely daughter, Dominique, which I just met moments ago. Let's give a quick round of applause for this legend tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, a quick round. There you go, there you go. I have a quick history on this gentleman, but I did learn in 81, he was a featherweight champion of the world. Tell us just quickly about your career from then till now. Well, I had a tremendous boxing career at the time when I was fighting great fights with Bobby Chacon, Bazooka Limon, Alexis Aguayo, Hector Camacho, you can name it all. Um, now I'm training fighters, I have managed fighters, promoted fights, uh, and all of you guys here in town, if you got anybody who you know wants to get into the fight game, you're quite free to come and see me. Either call me at Top Rank Gymnasiums, I'm all over town. I've been here for 27 years with my daughter, Dominique. She's born and raised in, da come on in over Las here, Dominique. Vegas. Get a little bit closer to us. And she graduated from Brown University, and I'm very happy with her. She knows how to fight. She knows the fight game very well. So okay, Boza, I'll tell you what, I've got to ask you right now. Do you think there, do you think there's a chance that the dear Dominique may be out there fighting one day? Sure. She she, she hit the pads. <laughs> she hit the pads with me. She hits the bag. She grew up in the gym. Dominique, I just yeah. spoke to you a few moments ago when 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 we were on break. You had some insight about your father. Take a moment now and tell the world what you think about your father. Um, he's great. He tries to be the best at everything he does, and no matter what it is, he says he's going to win, so watch out. Dominique, now you told me something a little bit interesting about him that maybe the world wouldn't know. He loves working on cars. Tell me about that just for a brief moment. Um, he loves working on his old cars. So far, he has four, but none of them work yet, so we're working on that. No working cars, but many working fighters. And Boza, before we go, I have a very important question to ask you. Uh -huh. Question is, tell me one thing that has brought you from 1981 till present, where you are today. Is it the love for your sport, the love for your family, for God? What would you say it is that's taken you from 81 till today, 2007? What would that be? Well, those are very tough, important questions you just asked. First, you say, is it God, is it love for your family? Uh, those are very important things. Love I for the sport? I have love for the sport. So I put them all in one puzzle. God comes first, my family comes second, and the sport is always with me, will always be with me for the rest of my life. Ladies and gentlemen, you heard it first right here. He put it to you like no one else can. Dominique, how about a quick word? And you're gonna close this for us, Dominique. Dominique didn't quite expect this, but you know what, she's going to. You heard your father just, just now say a few important words. What would you say in his career? Because you've seen a few of the years. What would you say has brought him to where he is today? I would say his love for, his love for his family and just being number one in everything he does, and that's what he's instilled in me as well. And his love for cars. All right, you heard it right there.